But you look at that little girl and you know that, that something happened to her. A psychotherapist, Robbie Ludwig, uh, Ludwig joins us now. Um, so, Robbie, the contention by some is that maybe the family made up the story. If, mm -hmm. if anybody even would do that, what is the mindset? How do you get to something like that? Well, there are con artists out there that love getting over. They love tricking people. They love getting money. Uh, there are some con artists that even like doing it even if they don't need the money. It's just the fun of the game of, yeah. of tricking people. You know, we don't really know about enough about the situation to know if that, in fact, did happen. But I think what we should be focusing on here is, number one, everybody should protect themselves from scams out there. But this little girl did have an incident happen yes. to her and I think we need to focus on her and her recovery, recovery. and I, I like the way KFC handled it as far as they are honoring giving this girl money for reconstructive yes. surgery if she needs it that that you know that says a lot and KFC is getting a lot of support online now as well after after they were quite vilified when this first mm -hmm. came out but we're wondering I mean does social media does it really make it easier to lie I think it makes it easier to have that knee-jerk reaction. I think it's easier for people who don't know the whole story to sling arrows. And we live in a very fearful society. And, and the first impulse is to assume that the person who is angry and vilifying somebody is correct. And I hope we learn something about this, that just because there is a lot of noise on social media that doesn't tell the whole story, perhaps that will help us all to take a deep breath Mm -hmm. and do a real investigation. Yeah, just think a minute before you type anything, just like a lot of times we have to think before we say anything. So, and, and you're right, best of luck to that little girl. And we'll, we'll keep everybody posted as yeah. to what's happening because at the end of the day, it's still about her and we don't want That's her right. to feel victimized again. She's been through enough.